fine. Good it's to nice see you. to see you. Congratulations on all your awards, all your hit records, all your tattoos. Now listen, um, you must be exhausted hanging out with all those younger guys, and I'm going to ask you to do something. Well, I wouldn't ask anybody else to. Let's see those legs, could we? Oh, they they are gorgeous. And listen, maybe you could drop by the uh, my room later on. We could talk about old times. I'm sure we could. Is there anything I can get for you to make you more comfortable? Actually, I'm pretty fine, except that I have to run right now. Really? Yeah. Okay, well, it was it's good, good seeing you, you again. Take care. See you soon. Thanks. All right, thanks. <laughs> well, I know we'd uh, be difficult to top this, but uh, we're going to try. We'll be right back. Don't go away. Harbor Stories and, and Joan Rivers. Thank you for coming by, ladies. Thanks for having us. Hi. Really, how are you? Actually, these are the cast members of La Cage. It's an evening at La Cage, which is the female impersonator show at Bally's Park Place. Thanks for coming by this afternoon. Would you please introduce yourself, Cher? My name is A. Andrews, and I portray Cher at an evening at La Cage, and I've been there since February. Yeah, I'm Charles Brandt. Um, I, I've been doing about three years here, and I've been in the cast about six years. And my name is Bobby Bruno. I am the MC of the show in the character persona of Joan Rivers, and I've been with the Atlantic City cast for just over a year. I gotta tell you guys, I mean, it's utter amazement, fascination. Mm. People see you and go, oh my gosh, I can't believe this. How does one get interested in being a female impersonator? Well, it, it's in Lacage, it's lookalikes. So, you know, basic structure of your face to look like the characters that you do. And the more that your face is already like that character, then you can put the makeup on and create an illusion. Do you have to really, really study and, and define and redefine the characters? And, and go back and perform for a while and go back and then maybe add a little shadow, darkening, lightning, well, the daylight, a little bit. Dreadful. A little scary. Okay. <laughs> but on stage, you have controlled lighting and it helps you really get the illusion across to the audience. What about tricks of the trade? Share some of them with us? Well, there's um, many, like we were speaking earlier, everybody has their own, but we all approach it from an acting level and we are all doing character studies are our individual characters, so you take their idiosyncrasies and a little bit of their persona and you apply them to you along with the physicalities and put it all together and package them to make an audience seem the, as though they're watching that person. I have to and tell it's you, interesting. I watched you putting on your makeup and I'm really jealous. I mean, look at the nails. What about, what's the <laughs> toughest part of it? Is it, you know, getting your shoes into, you know, women's heels or what's the I think the part? hardest part for me is probably this hair. The hair. Only because she's constantly doing something to her hair she's changing it so i'm constantly having to keep up on her but i find myself all the time popping in her videos listening to her music i don't think you can ever really know too much about the person you impersonate well we do have a couple clips from the show let's take a look at them now You guys, it is so amazing. How do people react to you when they ask, what do you do for a living? And you say, I'm a female impersonator. There's a myriad of reactions, but I think people like Charles was saying earlier on this level know that we are actors. We are all approaching our craft from an acting viewpoint, and that gives us a lot of credibility. We are in the longest running show of our kind, and it's the finest show in the nation. We're very proud of it. How do you react to it? I simply just tell them that I'm an entertainer. I can't believe it. Hi. You really didn't tell me that you were coming on the show. We I can't the believe three of my favorite we gorgeous stars on our show. How are you guys doing? Fine, Ray. So embarrassed. We should be. <laughs> you should be. Remember, it's an evening at Lacage, Valley's Park Place. It's been there for six years. We think six more. Thanks for coming by. We'll feeling that today is going to be a fun day. Our guests are beauty.